Hey guys, I'm Cody with Remind Past Life Pro, and today I'd like to teach you how to adjust saturation in the SUSV 10.2 Preview 1 Ultra. Anyways, my friends, let's get started. First, of the SUSV shader unzipped and ready to work with on the desktop. Access the folder. Access the shaders folder and locate final.fsh. Using Notepad++, open it up. So that we can access our main saturation control, we would need to first enable it. So scroll way down to line 2120. To turn it on, simply remove the two slashes. Now, let's move up to our main code piece. Find line 457. The number directly after sat boost, sat meaning saturation, is what we will be working with. In this case, larger numbers increase the saturation. Smaller numbers, of course, do the opposite. For my choice, though I may generally prefer a little more applied saturation, I'm gonna stick with the default 0.07F, or so because I'm just used to it. As for other numbers, the following comparison should sort your curiosity out. Before you leave, do make sure to save. Alright, my friends, if you have any questions, then do leave them in the comment section down below. If this SUS tutorial was of any use to you, then do hit that like button. And before you go, don't forget to check out my channel for some more Minecraft tutorials, some pro quality cinematics, and a bunch of other videos that you shouldn't miss. Anyways, I'm Cody, and this is Past Life Pro, where creativity is always a part of my life, as it will be for yours. Alright, see you guys! Mm -hmm.